Come, let us prepare, make some good profits today. Market left us some clues right here. We will be talking about that in today's video, including the testing of this algorithm and this algorithm. Very important levels you need to pay attention to because these algorithms will give us the 50 point day that may be coming soon. I will be talking about that. But before that intraday analysis, 9.50 a.m. We identified this yellow algorithm right here. Take a look. And also understanding that there is tapering algorithm here of this magenta. See this magenta level here as well as this other magenta level. So I mentioned if you want to take a starter position, you can take it off this yellow 474 level here on this breakout and another trade here off this green algorithm that you see that started forming. But that gave us a good starting position. And at 10, I talked about this green and magenta algorithm right here. And just take a quick look how the green algorithm started showing more confirmation on the breakout here. And you see how we bounced off that yellow 474 level on the breakout of this magenta. And we see how the green controlled algorithm started forming that liquidity build of this breakout here. Beautiful trade and it all started from understanding that we were tapering here and breaking out of that yellow selling all with them at the earlier post at 950 and we had the great trade here all the way to five day moving average right here now at 1121 right here i talked about this very very important blue algorithm that you see here at this intraday blue algorithm you need to see how the five days started forming ahead here. And you see how the right shoulder started forming on this squiggly magenta level. That's the five day moving average. You see the five day moving average forming here. And you needed to see how we broke out of that five day moving average forming that beautiful head and shoulder formation all the way down here. So this is a beautiful trade and it went all the way down to yellow 474 here. And thereafter we saw some continuation structure because we started identifying at 137, this yellow algorithm here. Now I want you to pay close attention to this blue algorithm that we identified off this five day moving average. You see five day moving average here. And we started forming the head of this red 474 and we identified this beautiful, beautiful yellow algorithm right here. So we caught the drop earlier from five day off that blue algorithm and we started seeing yellow forming as well. And just take a quick look how beautiful we have that breakout here giving us the last trade all the way to 20 day moving average at this red 473 level right there. Now, lastly, near to the end of the day, I talked about how you have to be very careful of this price action because we are still within the five day and 20 day moving average. And I talked about how the market will gravitate towards VWAP for safety and want to make a guess. Where did we close for the day? Absolutely right in the middle of where VWAP is. And you see how we closed at VWAP between five day and 20 day average right there. So members who did well today, you were trying to find profits in the charts because there are plenty of profits up or down. You do not have a bias. You were looking for profits in the charts and you were training your eyes to be looking at the algorithms and trading only as structure demands. You were patient. You remain focused. There's so much movement today but you were patient and focused in finding profits in the charts. You didn't overtrade. I took a look and maybe there were 10, almost 10 trading opportunities today, but all you need is one to three trades a day. That's all you need. Do not diminish your focus and your stamina. You have to remain focused to manage your risks. So do not overtrade. Three trades, good enough. Take your profits from the charts, set alerts, call it a day. Do not overtrade. There will always be profits to be found every day. So well done, members. Now, where do we go from here? Now, if you take a look at the larger macro 
context right here. You see that we are still forming that handle from the cup that we see right here. Now, there are several levels you have to pay very close attention here. The first being that we are still forming that handle and you see how that magenta algorithm is starting to be very, very respected here. And we tested the top of the magenta before being rejected here. And you see a tapering controlled algorithm that's starting to form. Now, in order for this handle to start forming, you need to pay close attention to where the five day moving average is, which will be about the 476 level here. And you have to see if we do break out of that liquidity level, preferably of this yellow 476 at the break of that green algorithm. So if that happens, you will see five day moving average forming that right shoulder as a support bringing us out of range right here. However, this can build more liquidity. The bulls can take a longer time to build liquidity. So you have to also pay close attention if we break out a little later. So you have to pay close attention to this green with them right here. Now, pay close attention to you see how we are supported by the blue algorithm right here because this is where we started tapering at the top level here. Now, you do see how we broke out today of that yellow rhythm and you see how we broke out beautifully as we mentioned at this 474 red level here. You see that beautiful breakout here. Now, if there is going to be continuation structure here on the breakout, pay close attention to the same yellow controlled algorithm here and as well as the blue tapering controlled algorithm right here. So the best scenario will be if the market is kind to us, we get a rejection of five day and we form that beautiful nested head and shoulder pattern here before we get another retest of this blue algorithm on the breakout of this yellow 474. So pay close attention to this yellow and this tapering blue controlled algorithm right here. Now, if this wants to head down, you need to see the green and you see how we started having that green selling. Previously, you need to see the green selling algorithm starting to be activated here. We don't see strong selling yet. At this point in time, the strongest selling algorithm that we see is just this magenta level right here. So you have to pay close attention whether we start having a stronger selling continuation after building more liquidity. And you have to pay close attention to this blue algorithm right here. Now, for this to break out on the upside from the green and magenta algorithm, as I was talking about, you need to see that orange algorithm starting to be activated right here. You see the orange has been activated previously. So pay close attention to whether this orange buying continuation algorithm is being activated on the rebuilding of liquidity right here. So you see how the market is building up to a bigger move here when we have the 20 day moving average and this blue algorithm here tapering from the top and defending at the bottom support with the 20 day moving average. You see how the five day moving average is defending the handle on the breakout right here as well on the green algorithm. And you see how this is a possible move at least to the blue algorithm. A good five point move retesting the all time highs and being able to retest the upper Bollinger. And on the downside, you see how this is a very strong, strong tapering algorithm as well. And the market is also building liquidity with this yellow algorithm right here. And we have a long way down to go if that happens, because if this is truly tapering, we will see that cup that has to close right here at 467. And that's exactly what I talked about in yesterday's video, where the bottom Bollinger is at right now. So you do see that possibility for both sides of the breakout right here. But trade as structure demands and we have to get in position and allow the market to be kind to us. So do not force a trade it may look beautiful now, but you have to trade as structure demands. Always remember that if the market wants to give it to us, we will be ready. But if it doesn't, we do not force a trade trade as structure demands. So thank you very much for watching. I will see you closer to opening bell.